This lecture theater is an example of a single zone space. Here's how the CAV works. For constant air volume system, or CAV in short, the supply air flow volume remains constant. This system is very ideal for single zone application, where the heat load is consistent across the entire air conditioned space. To maintain the room temperature when the heat gain varies, the supply air temperature of the system has to be varied. In this case, the room temperature drops. A thermostat located at the return air path senses the temperature change. It sends signals to the controller which compares the measured temperature with a set point and controls the automatic valve to regulate chilled water flow through the cooling coil. Because of the drop in temperature, the automatic valve is instructed to throttle, thus reducing the flow of chilled water to the cooling coil. The slower rate of chilled water flow will cause the temperature of supply air to rise. Now with a higher temperature supply air, the air-conditioned space temperature is returned to its set point. We can see from this example that the heat load may vary due to many factors. The temperatures in different rooms will therefore be different if it is not controlled properly. In a conventional CAV system, it has to be modified to cater for this variation of heat loads between rooms. In this case, if all the rooms are conditioned by a single CAV system, they will have a common supply air temperature. The supply air has to be cold enough to cool the room that has additional heat load due to the direct sunlight. As a result, one room is just fine whereas the other rooms may be too cold. Let us see how the CAV system with reheat works. The thermostat senses that the room temperature is too low. It sends a signal to activate the heater element to switch on, thereby raising the supply air to an appropriate temperature to warm up the room.